Oh boy, you know what to do. Linear algebra. We gotta do this the G main way. Oh boy. Okay, so what is our goal? Our goal is we want for some alpha where we want it, we want cosine minus sine, sine plus cosine. Oh, I'm sorry, actually, let me let me take that back, actually. Uh, let me write it specifically. Right, we want it in this form. Right, we want three cosine minus four sine. Right, dx, and then we want some whatever coefficient here, where it's just one dx. Or in other words, specifically, we want three co uh, what three sine uh, four cosine three sine here plus four cosine here as well okay because this is easier to integrate right this is just one this is just uh, ln of this whatever this is all right cool but we're given in our numerator we are given four sine plus three cosine and now we just need to find our coefficients 3 cosine minus 4 sine, b, 3 sine, oops, sorry, 3 sine plus 4 cosine. Okay, so we have two equations here, one for sine and one for cosine. So for, uh, for sine, we have negative 4a plus 3b. And then for cosine, we have 3, uh, this is 3a plus 4, uh, 4b. Okay, now I'm not a master of doing REF in my head, so I'm lazy. I'm just gonna straightforward just blaze through this. So, um, what if I multiply what 3, 4 here, I'll get. 12, uh, negative 12a plus 9b, 12, 4a, oh, I'm sorry, uh, 12a, and I get 16b. Okay, add these two together, we get 24 equals uh, 16 plus 9, that's 25b. Nasty, that's a nasty number. B is equal to 24 over 25. Nasty. Disgusting. Cannot believe they give such a coefficient. Okay. But then, oh, and then the nasty part here, let's see, 24 over 25. Which B do we want to plug in? Uh, do I want to do 3 times 24 or 4 times 24? I think I'll do, uh, I'll do 3 times 24. So 4 equals negative 4a plus 3 times 24 is like, what, 72? 72 days? Sorry, 72 hours and 3 days. That's how I think about it. Okay. So this is 100 over 25 minus 72. This is nasty as hell. Oh my god. We have a equals negative of, let's see, 4 under. That's 100. A uh, hundred. Let's see. This is like what? Eight. This is twenty-eight. Oh my God! Why would you do this to me? Fifty. Oh no! Sorry. Twenty-five. Divide four. Negative. Seven. Okay. So A is equal to negative seven over twenty-five. Awesome. Let's clean this up now because I don't want to see any of this. I don't want to see any of this. This is nasty. We're not even integrating, this is just linear algebra. But <clears throat> now that we know our answer, we know what a is. So now our answer is just negative 7, 25 of ln of 3 sine of x plus 4 cosine of x, and then plus 24 over 25 x plus c. Yeah. I hope this is the correct answer. Let's check. 24, 25, 7, 25. Uh, I think that's what I got. Yeah, let's go. Yep, yeah, that's correct. Awesome. Well, there you go. That's how you do it.
the linear algebra uh, method. Very useful, very common too, especially in advanced integration Bs. So definitely uh, practice this. Okay, uh, be careful not to go too fast because again, you know, you, we can we can tend to lose accuracy. So you don't want to mess up. All right. I hope that helps, and I'll see you guys in the next video.